Good day, mate. Forty here. So you've probably heard about how Australia is an island prison. Well, you have to you have to really experience it. It's it's not enough just to see the clips on Fox News, but look at how people are oppressed. I mean, everyone just in an island prison, just quietly doing what the government tells them to do. And, and look how brave they are, uh, trying to hide their suffering, you know, under the pose of eating out, having a good time, going to lunch with friends, going to work, hanging out with family. Like, look at this brave front by the Australian prisoners here how they're suffering, right? the, the government's just got them in an iron grip. Yeah, they, they bravely try to carry on, stiff up a lip and all that. But this is what life is like in an island prison. The, all the government restrictions. You know, the complete loss of liberty, autonomy, it's all gone now. But you can't even drive drunk. You can't beat your wife. You know, all those treasured Australian freedoms, all a thing of the past, mate. You probably think, oh, they don't make Aussies like they used to. You see how they're bravely trying to hide their pain. Okay. Gambling over there at the Crown Royal Casino. Eating out at fancy restaurants. Going on whale watching tours. But you know, look at the look at the violence inherent in the system. Look how frightened these people are of their oppressive central government. Look how cowed they are. Just absolute shells of their former selves. And bravely just trying to carry on like it's normal. I mean, trying to smile through their tears. Just trying to keep up appearances as though this is normal life. But you can sense the underlying desperation, the, the frustration, the absolute terror, the depression. This is not life, guys. This is life under a prison state. This is life in a police state. This is life in a surveillance state. All our treasured liberties, just as things of the past, mate. But we have to keep up the pretense, at least for our children, right? We've got to, we've got to be pretending to have a good time. We've got to pretend that life is just going on. But the oppressive hand of big government is just always looming over us. Right? No matter how bravely we try to keep up appearances, like the, the pain and the desperation, just keeps breaking through.